Before we start, I want to let you know that this video is going to be a bit of a rant. Most of this video is just me full on complaining, but I'm still gonna try to give information about him out, so let's begin. So, let me tell you about a guy named Lithium Locked You or just Lithium, as he's known. Now, I didn't include his name in the title because I didn't want to draw his attention to this video. So, why am I talking about him? Because he's a bitch. He locked my 2010 Roblox account for no reason. I didn't even know who he was. He has done this to tons of other people too. Let me first give you the full story from my experience with him. What the fuck is going on? He goes around locking accounts, mostly password guessed. So they lose all their valuable stuff. I had a 2010 Roblox account. It wasn't originally mine. I got it from a friend and decided to use it a lot. It had a group on it with group funds, and I wanted to use the account to start my Roblox piano career, pretty much playing piano in games, to impress people and stuff. I added an email to the account and felt safe. Out of nowhere, I got kicked out of the account. I tried logging back in. It didn't work. So I tried resetting my password, checked my email, and nothing. So I decided to contact Roblox support, contacted them nine times, and got no help. I noticed how the number of followers I had increased, so I checked to see who followed me. It was Lithium. I took one second on his account and realized I was a victim of his dumb locking things. I lost all of my friends on that account. All the money on the account, everything, everything was gone. I tried contacting him, he used to have his Discord in his bio. He couldn't do anything. He didn't even care. He said he does this for fun. What fun does he get from this? Moral of the story, to FA all your accounts. And don't join Name Snipe or old Roblox groups. What the fuck is going on? First of all, he claims he isn't violating Roblox's terms of service. Yes, the fuck he is. Doing anything that gets a user kicked out of an account is against their TOS now you might say. Oh, but Max is only doing it to password guest accounts, and that's a huge no-no. From what I can see, some of these accounts are not password guest. For example, how the fuck do you get access to an account called Floor? Also, I just noticed that there is another account called You Can't Login. So I guess this video is talking about multiple people now. Also, he targets accounts with valuable stuff, like limited items and off-sale items. What's even worse is that, he asks the victims to pay him to unlock their accounts. That's outrageous. People never asked him to lock their accounts in the first place, so why should they have to pay him to undo the damage he caused? This is a huge scam. Like those New York costume people who try to get in your photo to ask you for money. What the fuck? I can understand him locking people's accounts who are paidos and such, but he only does this to people he wants to piss off. What the fuck is going on? No clue. But what I can tell is that he begs Roblox support for access to the account, then locks it. Or he just uses a bot. I don't know. This Reddit comment explains it the best. So if you go on his Twitter, it's just people asking him to unlock their account, and he says, hit me up on Discord. Now, I'm obviously not going to, but pretty much, he just asks you to pay him, so you can get your account back. What the actual fuck? I didn't ask for you to lock my account, so why do I have to pay you? And he's making fun of the people who are mad at him for it. You locked their accounts without their knowledge. What do you expect? Take a look at this Reddit post, for example. He's legit scaring people and making people lose real-world money. And this person is even saying he ruined their lives. Like, how is he not banned yet? And he takes lock requests too. I do not know how to even explain my anger. What the hell? And there are multiple of these people. Take a look at Eerie. He has a buy to stay protected shirt. So I have to buy tons of shit so my account doesn't get locked. That's freaking stupid. That's like a pay-to-win game. But instead of pay-to-win, it's pay-to-not-get hacked. Also, this is a huge lie. Just showcasing accounts from the Roblox account collection. Yeah, right? What the fuck is going on? 
So he has a Discord server, which I'm going to join on an account that I haven't used in years. Let's join. And, oh my, that's a lot of words. So here we are on my alt. Oh, so on Discord, they follow the rules. Yet on Roblox, they don't. That makes full sense. Why is he acting like he's famous? No, you're not. Shut the fuck up. This status is making me want to jump off a This server was made not that long ago. So it obviously has nothing in it. On May 19th, 2023, this account was made. Is this an alt? I think it is, or his old account got banned. I could wonder why. Why do they say GG so much? Also, you can pay him 500 Robux to learn how to lock, I think. That is only $6 in America. What a dumb price for a tool so powerful. Also, from what I am assuming, Roblox does do some action by banning their accounts. But it's only if the account hasn't been active in years. Also, he is Spotify, and I was going to roast his music taste. But I know none of these artists. I know they are rap artists. But I don't want my eardrums to be killed. I mean, I listen to Hollywood and Dad, but they are more like a rock band than rappers. Okay, I'm done with this server. So I didn't really plan this video fully. And you probably understood what I was trying to say. Jude's lock you. Then you have to pay to get your account back. And Roblox doesn't care. Yeah, yeah, bye.